steel, one of the most important materials in the modern world. Because of its versatility, the demand for steel is always increasing. This makes the steel industry's demand for energy increase alongside it. To fight this growing demand for energy, the steel industry is advancing and creating new methods to make steel with less energy consumption and more useful byproducts. To demonstrate how the steel industry saves energy, let's use a cube. This cube may not seem like much, but it shows many ways the steel industry saves energy. The metal this cube is made with was made by using both recycled steel scrap and iron directly reduced using hydrogen instead of carbon. Using hydrogen instead of carbon during the reduction process of iron makes water the byproduct instead of carbon dioxide. Before the cube was cast, it was modeled using modern simulation programs to see where porosity would form and inclusions would go. This allows for multiple mold configurations to be tested and adjusted before any metal is even poured. This improves the quality of the steel, increasing its strength before any heat treatments have been applied. The mold this cube was cast with was made using green sand. Green sand is a type of molding sand bonded together with clay and water, making it reusable. All of this allows the cube to be made with minimal inclusions, excess, and waste. Even after the cube is made, there are still examples on how it can save energy. This cube could be made of a lightweight steel. Lightweight steels allow machines to run with improved efficiency since they have less weight. To talk more about this, here's Mike Piston. What do you think one cubic foot of steel weighs? And a lot of people will answer in the range of 250-300 pounds at most. But what you don't realize is that just wait, a cubic foot of steel weighs just under 500 pounds. And one of the goals of lightweight steel is just to really get that density reduction on the order of maybe 10 to 15 percent. But lightweight steels are not the only method of saving weight on parts. High strength steels allow for some parts to use less material, making the overall machine lighter. These are all ways the steel industry saves energy. To end this video, here's Mike Piston again. Most everything we make is, is metal, uh, and, and people don't realize that it's not just a one and done, you cast it, you send it out the door, or you machine it to shape it, send it out the door. There's a host of engineering issues that you know, we can help make more efficient and you know, help the industry, and there's just no shortage of need for metal in the